Hi and welcome to the video training of JavaScript. In this video training we will learn about classes in JavaScript. The class declaration creates a new class with a given name using prototype based inheritance. For example we have a class polygon. It has a constructor that receives height and width and return area which is a product of height into width. And then we are going to console.log new polygon 4 comma 3 dot area. So let's see this in action. I'm going to create a file here, uh, a project directory called class. Okay, and it's more hyper class. Class sublime editor class dot HTML and I need a script block here so I can code my JavaScript so class polygon it's, uh, okay and then we have the constructor here and it receives height as a parameter and width as a parameter and this returns this dot area equals height into width and now we are going to use this class here soul.log polygon dot new polygon to create a new object of the class polygon dot area going to pass 4 comma 3 dot area sorry that's after the class this is like this yes okay now if we save this file and if, if i go into my project directory uh, home and projects javascript class and if i double click this it will open in the browser and if i want to see the results i'll have to go to more tools developer tools and console tab and here you can see 12. similarly i can change this to uh any other class name you can say box and here's height and width so box should have equal height and width so 10 by 10 dot area refresh this but polygon is not a class because i changed the class name so this should be box now okay save this and refresh now we got 100 which is a product of 10 into 10 okay uh, a simple declaration a simple declaration is the is in the following example we first define a class named rectangle then extend it to create a class named filled rectangle note that super used in the constructor can only be used in constructors and must be called before the this keyword can be used so let's try this uh, example here i'm going to create a class call rectangle rectangle and within this class I have a constructor and which receives a height and a width and here I'm going to say this dot name equals rectangle this dot name this dot sorry this dot height equals height and this dot width equals width so this is our base class rectangle now i'm going to create another class that is called filled rectangle extends rectangle so this is a child class of a rectangle class and here we again we have a constructor which receives a height width and a color and within this constructor i'm going to call the constructor of the super class which is rectangle in our case I'm going to pass height and width class and I'm going to say this dot name this dot name equals filled rectangle and then I'm going to say this dot color equals color so that's pretty much it and if I call this uh, class here console.log 
and if I say new field rectangle 40 10 red and if I run this clause here we have uh, class okay rotate HTML you see the constructor I get filled rectangle and you can see that it has the properties red height 20 name filled rectangle and width 10 so if I want to change this to like 50 and 60 and color to blue and if I refresh the browser again I get a new object that has the color blue height 50 name filled rectangle and width 60 so that's how classes work in JavaScript uh, now if you want to attempt to declare a class twice it will give an exception or a syntax error saying uncaught syntax error identifier foo has already been declared so if I try to uh, redefine a class rectangle again here and if I run my project you see I get an error identifier rectangle has already been declared and the same error is thrown when a class has been defined before using the class expression so if you have defined a variable and stored the reference of class in that variable and you define the class again it will throw the same error thanks for watching this video please subscribe to my youtube channel uh, you can also contact me if you need any help thanks